Hey y'all, Jazz Creations Our Sanity here. So today I'm starting out in my shop. I am going to make little shot glasses. So I've got this shot glass mold that, oh I don't know, I think I got it from Michael's. Um, but anyway, I found these cute little colored pencils at the dollar store and I'm going to make shot glasses out of them. So what I've done, um, they come in, well, at the dollar store I went to, they only had packs of eight. So in these, in each of these, there's two packs. So what I've done is just stuck them in there figured out um, where I need to cut them and then I'm using my Dremel to cut them off to where I'm leaving a little lip so it's it's not flush with the bottom um, yeah I'm trying to get them all cut the same size not really working too well but you know, it's going to be what it's going to be. I think it's going to be really cute. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to finish this one here. I'm going to have to wash my mold because I've got dust and everything in here now. So, after I cut this one to where I need it, I get everything washed up. Then I'll meet you back inside and for the next step. See you then. Okay, y'all, I'm back. I gotta make this quick, or you're gonna hear my herd of elephants upstairs stomping around. So, it's all cleaned. I've got my pencils in here. They're, they're no particular way. I just made sure that, or tried to make sure that I didn't have two of the same color next to each other. So, I got them placed where I want them. Oh my goodness, they're all running up there. Um, I've got my resin mixed up. I am using the liquid diamonds. Um, I will have all supplies listed in the description below. But I've already got it mixed up. It's been sitting, oh, I don't know, probably 20 minutes or so. Um, just to help. Um, most of the bubbles are all popped. Um, there's just a little on top. But... Anyway, so I'm going to, and it's just clear resin. Let me get this out of here. And I am just going to pour it over my pencils here to, to fill up the mold. Let that kind of settle. Oh, I should have gloves on, y'all. I'm just moving the pencils a little bit. Make sure that the resin um, is all around them. I'm just going to babysit this and keep pushing them down until this starts to cure. So, I'm going to go ahead and do these other three. Uh, I will, after I'm done babysitting this, I will cover it and leave it 
set for 24 hours and then we'll be back to demold. Okay guys, we're back. This has been sitting overnight. Um, gosh, this was a pain. I kept watching it and poking the pencils back down. As you can see, I finally put some tape to try to hold them down, but I don't know. I'm gonna have a mess to clean up. I'm gonna have to sand um, and then I've got some bubble bubble trapped under here so I'll have to fix that um, let me I'm gonna get some gloves on because I don't want to get fingerprints on these so I think next time I'm going to leave the pencils whole and just stick them in here. Um, and then once I fill it with resin, I can use tape to then put it over the, the top of the pencils to hold them down. And then when it's done curing, just cut the tips of the pencils that are sticking out of um, the resin, if that makes sense. So, uh, let's see what we've got here. <laughs> that is pretty cool. So, I just got some stuff to take off here. I don't know. Can you see that? Whoop, nope, there. So, just some stuff to take off here. Um, this one's not too bad. Look how cool that is. That's so cute. Okay, let's see what the other ones look like. So I'm just going to take my knife here and I'm going to cut off this extra all the way around. I'm going to try to do this in frame so you guys can see, but I've got to be able to see it too and my eyes are not the best. So I usually got to hold it pretty close to my face so that I can see it. Yeah, hopefully, so you guys get the idea of what I'm doing. Um, so let me get all this cut off and then I'll be back. Okay, so I've got all of these cut or trimmed. Now for the bottom here, I'm gonna show you on one what I'm gonna do. This one has that bubble. So I'm going to use a pin here and just poke that just to make sure that it's open. Okay. Now I'm using some UV resin and I'm just going to squirt a little bit out here on this plastic. And I'm going to, I don't know if you guys can see it, I'm going to use this um, 
It's a silicone brush. It's a really fine, um, tiny tip on it. And I'm going to, I'm going to, I don't know if you guys can see, I'm going to dip that in my resin I put over here, get a little bit on the end, and I'm going to poke that down in that bubble to fill it. Look at how stinking cute these things are, you guys. How cute. These turned out super cool. And and I went ahead, let me show you. I went ahead and put um, a felt bottom on these. Look how cool that is. would be so neat sitting on a desk it make great gifts for teachers you can see I had my pens and pencils and things in this one here's some little clippies paper clips maybe some mints so yeah as always thank you guys so much for watching please like share subscribe and leave me a comment. Let me know what you think about these. Till next time. Bye.